Michaela, thank you very much and good morning, everybody. Let's take a look at your mid Michigan forecast and we'll start with our computer forecast model. We call future track. This will outline will it, what it thinks will happen graphically here over the next 48 hour period or so. We've had a line of some showers that have been off to our south and west, and those are likely going to be moving into and through the area as we head into the mid to late morning hours and probably through the afternoon. There could be a rumble of thunder in there, but we're not looking for anything strong or severe. Watch what happens as we go through the day here. Uh, this model breaks some of it up and then it brings another wave of some moisture in as we go into the late afternoon and even around the dinner hour. I don't think it's going to rain all day, but there will be a showery situation that sets up with mainly cloudy skies and again, perhaps a rumble of thunder in there. We may clear out for a portion through the uh, evening, through the later evening and the overnight hours. But I think by the time we go through Friday, we're likely going to see some more shower activity develop. This particular model is not real bullish on that, but there are other ones that are showing more rain showers uh, earlier as we go through the day on Friday. So suffice to say, more showers are likely and you can see, especially off from Lansing to the south and east. And this is as we get into Saturday morning, likely for at least the first part of Saturday, some rain showers. And then once that system goes through, you can almost see the way the clouds start to come in again from the north and west. Now that's going to filter in some uh, cooler and drier air. It may be cool enough to actually, on the west side of the state, see some lake effect or lake enhanced rain showers as we get into uh, Saturday. But I don't think those will make it all the way to mid Michigan and Lansing and Jackson and Detroit. But just the idea, there may be some uh, some cloud cover still hanging around. I would expect that as we go through the second part of Saturday, despite the fact that the second part of Saturday may be dry, but probably a fair amount of cloud cover. Let's start with today, though, as we look at our forecast details for mid Michigan and southern lower Michigan, a few showers likely to develop as we head on through the morning and the daytime hours here. Maybe a rumble of thunder, a strong southwest wind should still push our temperatures today into the lower 70s. That's about 10 degrees above average for this time of the year. For tomorrow and our Friday, uh, we'll uh, going to see some showers develop again. That'll go into the evening hours, so that will impact your Friday night high school football games. High temperatures only in the lower 60s there, so you can see we're already starting to cool down with that northwesterly wind. And then as we get into Saturday, there may be a few lingering showers, especially through the first part of the day and cooler with highs only in the mid 50s. Yeah, we go from being well above normal to now being a little bit below normal. The good thing is, and something to look forward to, the takeaway from me to you folks as a forecast, as you look at our Fox 47 seven day forecast picture here, is we've got a uh, drier situation that's going to be setting up with a fair amount of sunshine as we get into Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. So several dry day days there with temperatures increasing from the low 60s into the upper 60s, maybe even pushing 70 degrees. So that is certainly something to look forward to there. Uh, the other thing is look at the overnight low temperatures and some of those days may be in the lower 40s. So there's a good and a take, a uh, bad and a, and a good with it. Uh, uh, but uh, something to look forward to uh, as we get into the beginning to the middle portion of next week. That is a look at your forecast. Make it a great day, everybody. I'm Fox meteorologist Kevin Craig.